To get a leg up on the competition, Texas State University wants to move beyond old school ideas. The school's engineering program is entering new territory with civil engineering. KXN's Gary Cooper reports on how they're expanding to help the next generation build smarter so it lasts longer. Engineer James Finch once said the engineer has been and is a maker of history. The same can sort of be said about the new engineering program at Texas State University, according to Dr. John Schemmel. There are only two institutions that at an undergraduate level have an academic program that is inclusive from freshman to, to senior year that, that covers technology application infrastructure, and that's MIT and, and UC Berkeley. And in case you didn't follow what the program actually is, we'll try this. It can be a roadway, it can be a building, it can be a bridge, a water treatment plant. It, it's whatever the, the particular structure will be. We're looking at ways to actually have it uh, designed and constructed uh, more effectively, more efficiently, better use of materials, manage its life cycle so that it lasts much longer with less need for repair. Part of the study will also be using technology to monitor not how strong something is, but how it performs while it's being built and after it's built. One of many tools giving them a competitive edge. Our engineers will be able to become licensed professional engineers as they would from any other civil engineering uh, program in the state. They will have this additional knowledge that other students will not have. The new program starts this fall semester. Gary Cooper, KXAN News. Dr. Shamel says the school hopes to have 500 students enrolled in about five years with the goal of getting to 700 students in about seven years. This program funnels into one of the most in-demand professions and demand will be growing. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, there will be a 27% jump in the need for civil engineers by 2022. The median salary for civil engineers is $65,000. That's according to payscale.com. They can make much more than that, but an entry-level job might start at about $47,000.